Hey everyone, I've seen one or two comments on my swimming tutorial video saying that with big waves you could glitch out of them and fly in the air. I had no idea what was happening, but lately, as I've been working on my drivable boats asset, I encountered this issue myself with boat buoyancy and also with the same swimming implementation. The problem is, the Unreal Engine buoyancy has to be overlapping the water actor to work, and if the waves are taller than the water plane, Z location, you can climb above the water plane in a wave and bypass the end overlap event. Put simply, the waves what must remain below the water plane. I found a way to lower the water level with the max waves height offset parameter, which I thought was great, but it turns out it doesn't actually affect any function. Boats will float exactly where they were floating before, except now it looks like they're in the air. Continuing on this lead, I opened buoyancy component in C++ to look for the buoyancy float target and subtract the float value. In the process, I found the overlap event that affects only buoyancy components in the water actor, under notify actor begin overlap. Actor is important because that means we can simply add a collision volume above the water as a component and it will count as the same actor. So we can just extend the overlapping height of the water body without C++. So let's go ahead and do that. Simply select your water body and click Add Box Collision. Set the width appropriately and make it large enough to be as high as the highest waves. Then, set its collision profile to water body collision, and that's it. Now, buoyancy won't be ignored at these heights, 